What up guys? So this is going to be kind of like the first video since my other video saying what we're going to be doing. So the other night when I was just kind of just messing around going through some old boxes, I found something freaking awesome that I thought I had lost for years. I actually found a iPod Classic 4th Gen and uh, I'm going to show you two little clips right now. And in those clips you can see or not see, I'm not really sure how well it picked up on the video, but this is from 2005. I actually got this as a Christmas gift. Um, it's a 20 gig uh, iPod Classic and it's got a troll of songs on it from like nostalgia purposes. The thing is I plugged it up, tried to charge it, and I think the battery's bad. Um, that's what I think. So I went online, uh, Amazon obviously, and I picked up a battery and I picked up a little kit to replace the battery and see if this fixes it. I don't know if it's going to, but it can't hurt anything because the way it sits right now, aside from nostalgia purposes, it doesn't work. So the two things that I picked up are, bam, these things. Um, I picked these up. This is basically just a, a battery from Instant. Uh, it's whatever, it's a rechargeable lithium ion battery, obviously made in China. They give you these little plastic things to, to take apart your, your iPod, but um, upon doing some more research, uh, I found a company called, how, how is this pronounced? Uh, Isimo, I-S-E-S-A-M-O. And they make this look little stainless steel thing. And it's supposed to be pretty flawless. Uh, so we're gonna try to use that tool instead of those little plastic tools because those things are usually a pain. So I'm gonna switch view and we're gonna go dive down into this. And I think this angle that I'm gonna be using is actually probably gonna work better than actually in the game room because I actually have a desk I can go from the other side. Um, I think I can make it look better. Uh, so we're gonna try that and see if we can not mess this up. I haven't watched any videos yet on how to do it. I'm assuming if I can replace screens and iPhones, I should be able to replace the screen in this, but I've seen worse, right? So let's jump over to that and see what kind of damage we can do. See in a few. All right guys, so we're gonna learn together. Um, I think this is actually a really good view too. You guys should be able to see almost everything that I see. Uh, so this is a little instrument also too. You'll need one of these. This is like the best thing I ever made or bought. It's, it's from a product company called Manch. Um, and they pretty much have every kind of screwdriver you would need. Now one video I watched told me to like pop this, like it would pop, but I'm not seeing it pop. So we're just gonna try to get this actually open with this guy. I don't know how well it's gonna work, but we will uh, we will try. So this is the tool, it's very flexible. Um, I don't know how well it's gonna work for this, but um, we'll see. Now up here, it looks like I have the most gap. So according to this, you can get this tool in here. Okay, so I know we jumped a little bit into the video here, but I managed to start getting it. The problem was is, like all videos, nothing is as easy as it freaking says it is. 
So I've managed to start getting some of the lip here. Um, but it is not fun to do by any means. Um, these, I guess, were like not meant to be opened by us. I think I got that one popped, yep. So now it's a matter of just getting these other ones popped. Okay, so that was a nightmare. Um, I believe it goes this way. Okay. So this, they said, comes off. Just comes off. What stri What strikes me is like there's no. There was no screws like. In this piece, I, I don't I don't understand why there was no screws in this piece, but whatever. All right. So here's the battery that was in it, um, and there is apparently a screw right here that you have to actually take out. Is what it said. So it said like hold on to the board. And like get this out. Maybe like a little pair of tweezers would be better for that. I don't know. Also, one thing I said too, I said this thing right here is like extremely hard to get out. Is it because it's like glued in or something? Um, they said you can try heat So I'm clearly not able to get the best grip on this so I, I'm just gonna try to hold down here Grab these and then just kind of So I'm gonna be 100% honest here boys. I, I'm not sure exactly what did record or what did not record I'm gonna have to go back to my video files, but basically I got everything took apart on it um, I did get it to pop got the hard drive finished I got it put back together and I forgot to put this little screw back in and I don't even necessarily know what this screw is for um, all I know is with my OCD if I didn't put that screw back in uh, I would freak out so we are uh, we we're putting that one screw back in because I don't know what's for so I just know that if I didn't put it back in I would have lost my mind so we did get a working iPod everything seems to be cool uh, I'm gonna test the charging feature well boys I can safely say um, I did try it off camera and it charges um, for whatever reason it didn't charge from the power block that I was using but I'm thinking because it was so old um, it wouldn't charge one of the newer power blocks so I took the cable plugged it into my anchor hub over there and it worked just fine so yeah that was the original battery that was in there we got it swapped and I'm gonna go charge my iPod fourth gen and I'm gonna go listen to some music from 2005. That should be interesting. Um, expect more videos. If you guys enjoyed this video at all, uh, let me know. It's just random stuff that I do throughout the day usually. And I figured why not just record it for you guys because I love Apple stuff. I love Apple stuff. I'm a sheep, I admit it, absolute sheep. So. Yeah, that's all I have for you guys. Like, comment, subscribe, turn notifications on. Let me know what maybe Apple videos or products you want to see. Um, I'm always looking. So, peace, guys. Thanks.